to check out the food. Oh my god. Mm. Delicious. Hey, hey, hey. I'm just good. Sixteen dollars is a tip. Where do I sign us in here? Yeah, that's just the same one. It's not. That's what the twenty percent tip would be. Oh, that was so good, though. I was so pleasantly surprised. With it. So today we are getting ready to leave this area, go back up in through the lodge, I think. Why am I looking over here? The camera's on my face. Head back into the lodge, head down to the boat docks. I know it would sound funny going to the lodge when the boat docks or the water is right here. But in today's video, I think we're going to rent a boat and go out on Bay Lake. Pontoon, possibly? It all depends on what stuff stuck in a truck wants. So, God, this is going to suck. This is going to be the worst video ever. But here, there is a geyser that erupts like every hour. You can see the hot pools of awesome water there. And there's a geyser right there in front of us. And all the water that flows into the lake actually comes from their swimming pool upstream. You're going to be the star of the show because I'm recording with these. Just in case that messed up. Only 30 second clip, guys. This video is going to rock. So as you can see, the stream goes under this bridge, and that water comes right out of the swimming pool area. But not only that, there's a waterfall that goes up into the lodge where there's a spring that feeds the swimming pool. All this is all one continuous stream. It's, it's one continuous water feature, as Tommy Travels would say. So I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's Space Mountain over there. I can't zoom in with my glasses. And then right behind Space Mountain, you'll see that white thing over there. That is the brand new Tron roller coaster that's going to be opening soon. But we're not going into the parks today. We're actually coming over here to do something pretty fun that you re I rarely get a chance to do. And this is the main lobby of the Contemporary Resort. It looks so contemporary. So, um, I need to tell you guys something. My sunglasses are down to 26% battery, so once these run out, I may end up switching to cell phone video. I know, I know, it's gonna suck. But you gotta do what you gotta do when you're doofus and uh, leave your camera at home. So this is the new tower that was just recently built for the last couple of years. And this is the original right here. It's a pretty incredible place, but we're not focusing on that. And we are definitely not going to go inside and explore too much in the history of this place. By the way, for anybody that's curious, yeah, President Nixon did give his famous checkered speech from inside this place where he resigned as president of the United States. So we got Steph over here doing her video. Look at that. She's got a, you got to do a selfie, right? You got to do a selfie. And then we're heading over here to the sandbar. And uh, I think we're going to get one of these boats over here and head out onto the lake, out onto Bay Lake. Maybe take you close to the Magic Kingdom and get a water's view 
Yeah, that should be fun. So we got our boat, but Steph had to go get a water to take out onto the water. Makes sense. But before you get on the boat, you got some fun stuff to do down here. You got a pool table, and then you got this beautiful water here at Walt Disney World's Magic Kingdom area. And one of those boats right there is the one we're going to be taking out. Okay, so we are coming over here to rent ourselves a pontoon. And it should be a beautiful day out on the water. At least 30 minutes worth. Okay, now we can record. <laughs> now we can go. Now I'm ready. All right, let's head down to our craft. Yeah, do they so they do they still rent out fishing boats, bass boats and stuff, or is it just tours now? Um it's just tours now. Okay. So you have a guide, they know where all the like secret spots are. And there is no more than mini boats that we used to ride back in the day. Alright. So this is it. Alright, so we are heading out. I got all this stuff. It's way different than the truck. What? Are you talking to me on your video? I said do you think he's a Alright, so let's uh I'm gonna. I'm not gonna gun it. Go walk. Go ahead and walk up there before I pull up. All right. So this is our. I gotta drive and record people. We gotta run. I just hit some boat motors and everything else on these other boats. Oh my god. I'm a truck driver. How come I can't do it right? <laughs> This is terrifying, people. It's terrifying. So this $45 boat ride is going to cost me like $10,000 <laughs> to escape. So at the moment, we are passing the back side. understand that. The back side of the contemporary. And we're going to head to behind the Magic Kingdom. So something's going on. I don't know if we're where we're not supposed to be because the motor just died down. It is a full board. And we, at the moment, are right in this little area, this little island. Or no, we're over here. So the castle's right here behind these trees. But for some reason... Oh, I can't walk, I'm connected. <laughs> the motor is going very, very slow. Very odd. So what's going on is there's something wrong with our boat. But it looks like there is... A, a person in a boat over there which is like maintenance or something that comes and checks on the boats if you break down or something in the middle of the water he seems to be getting closer maybe he knows we're in distress what do you think well, maybe he thinks yeah maybe he thinks we're chilling okay so we are getting rescued out here in the lake at Walt Disney World because uh, some of the grass within the lake got caught up in our motor and yes, this is now shot with my telephone. Does somebody get to get wet? Uh, no one's getting wet. We try not to get into the lake if we can avoid it. We only try to get in for emergencies. Well, this is an emergency. I need you in the water. <laughs> Ahoy! Ahoy! Um, I'm waiting for one of you guys to get in the water and uh, peel this stuff off. <laughs> What's the problem, Dave? Uh, I think this is the one that has a lever. Which number is this? this is Come on, fall in. Fall in. So. <gasps> Jordan taught me right. Ah, there's a lever down here. God, you guys are cheating. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm behind the wheel. We are being towed, actually. You see, I'm getting towed right here with another boat back into the middle of Bay Lake. It's an adventure. It's nice. I do have to say, Disney takes care of you. Safety, number one priority. They got enough people out here on the water to uh, make sure you're safe. Thank you, Walt Disney World, for making today extremely special. Uh, you guys went above and beyond, saving us from the stormy seas out there by towing us back in. And uh, did us a little solid at the end. As we, I can't. I don't want to say what you guys did. I don't want other people to expect it. But uh, if anybody at Walt Disney World sees this video, thank you for everything you did. It was pretty amazing. What an adventure! 
Well, we are on the fourth floor inside the Contemporary Resort, and this Mary Blair's artwork is right here. Normally you see it from the monorail. It's one of those things that it's a it's a it's something you have to see while at going to the Magic Kingdom. It's just amazing and it's it's a beautiful piece of artwork. And if you don't know who she is, she actually pretty much well, if you look at the characters there, it, you will recognize it's a small world. So a monorail siding right to the middle of the hotel. Normally I'm on that side. I'm I'm actually in the monorail. I'm never walking beside it when coming through this building. This is so hard shooting video with my phone. I don't know how people do it. But before I end this video and today's adventure mostly shot with my sunglasses from Ray-Ban, I'm gonna go over here to this far window, maybe go out on the balcony and have a quick gander at the Magic Kingdom. I really wish my glasses would not have died because this is the moment I've been waiting for all day out all, all the fun stuff that I've been doing this is the moment. Sitting on the rooftop here at the Contemporary Resort just for this one photo. Now for those of you that come here, where I'm sitting right now, they got some seating. This is like the perfect spot to watch the fireworks over the castle at the Magic Kingdom. Check out this view. In just a minute, that monorail will be taking off that way. But we're going to follow the one that comes out of that door. There it goes on its journey to the parks. Look how picturesque and beautiful this is. You got Space Mountain, the brand new Tron roller coaster side by side with the castle over to your left. Make it focus, there we go. That's the shot, that's the money ticket. Yeah, it's quite beautiful. We got Space Mountain right here. We got Tron Light Cycle going in right there. That's the show building inside Tron, and that's the outdoor canopy part. And right over there, I guess, got Cinderella's Castle. How beautiful is this? At nighttime, I'm telling you, if you guys come to Walt Disney World, come over here to Contemporary, hit the elevator for the fourth floor, come out here, sit down, and enjoy the view because the fireworks from here are spectacular. Anyway, until the next time, thanks for watching this probably very terrible video because it's my first attempt doing an all video with these. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. Until then, peace out, everybody.